Good morning, explorers. It's a beautiful day in January to be out up north. I'm in Lemington visiting my grandparents. Mrs. Chisholm wasn't able to come with me this time, but I know that we're still gonna have a lot of fun and find some really cool things. Just wow, look at this scenery. And I can't wait to see what we find on the Ice Age Trail today. Let's go. I just got in the car. I got my new travel partner here with me today. And we are on our way, leaving my grandparents' house right now onto that next destination. Let's take a look. Oh, look at, here's a train tracks. We're gonna talk about that today. Lemington is where we are. So beautiful. Explorers, I'm about 310 miles away from Deer Creek and about which would take about four and a half hours. I'm at the Tuscobia State Trail out here in Rice Lake. This trail is really unique because when it was first um, used, it was used as a railway. Eventually, they stopped using it because of changes in transportation had also changed and they decided to turn this trail into a recreational trail. The cool thing about this is that this is only the second railway turned recreational trail in the state of Wisconsin. Another really cool part as I walk this way to this other sign here, you'll see that part of the Tuscobia State Trail is also a part of the Ice Age Trail. So as I go over here and I can see that there's a map and some other important information, right here it tells me that it's also a part of the Ice Age Trail. Come along with me as we explore um, in today's video. Some of the things that I'm noticing as you can see behind me there is that this is a very straight path, which makes sense because this used to be a railway. So trains used to use this part of the trail, which makes sense as to why they would have chosen an area that has a flat surface and that goes directly across. Let's keep walking and see if we notice anything else. So I'm stopping right here, explorers, because I'm noticing that the elevation of the trail is changing. Right now, as I look down, the elevation goes down and then there's a steep incline right there behind me. It makes me think about that this trail used to be used for a railway and makes me think, hmm, I wonder if the train was able to make it down this hill okay and back up to that steep incline, or I'm wondering if there might have been a, a trestle located here. Again, a trestle is a bridge that is used along railways um, that helps create that flat surface when they were building the railroad tracks. Let's keep walking. Whew, I just made it back, friends. We walked about a mile, a little bit over a mile and a half, and it took us about 45 minutes to do. This was my first winter hike of the season and man was it fun. Tomorrow I'm going to continue to explore a little bit more of the Tuscobia State Trail and provide you with some more um, fun facts and interesting parts of Wisconsin's history. Join me tomorrow as I continue on. It's day two. I'm still up north ready to keep exploring the Tuscobia State Trail. This part of the trail does not overlap with the Ice Age Trail. I wonder if it's going to look any different. We're out 
here at the Descovia State Trail. This trail originally was a railway and closed because it wasn't being used as much anymore. As you can hear, there is an active train that does cross part of the path, which you're hearing right now. This part of the trail is not a part of the Ice Age Trail. Um, it's a separate portion, but still just as beautiful and a lot of fun to explore. Oh my goodness. Mrs. Chisholm's not here with me today because I'm up north at my grandparents' house. But wow, I know that Mrs. Chisholm would love this map just as much as I do. Hmm, I wonder we, where we are on this map. Huh. Well, I see right in here. I see Birchwood. Oh, Lemmington. Right here. This is where I am hiking right now. Again, on that Lemmington segment of the Tuscobia State Trail. Wow, there's so many things to look at. It's telling us about the railroad. Hmm. All right, let's keep going. Wow, what a beautiful day. I can see there's lots of snowmobile tracks here from all the snowmobilers coming out to enjoy this part of the trail. And I just came from that direction. I'm now gonna continue walking and this is where I'm gonna see the railroad that we just heard. As you can see, it looks beautiful. What a great day for hiking. I'm on this segment that's along County Road C out here in Lemmington. And boy, fourth graders, I can't even describe to you the beauty that I'm seeing right now.